Hey everybody, welcome back to Mission Control for a quick tips video. In this video, we're going to talk about using syntax to update a queue list. You may find yourself in a situation that requires you to merge slash replace the programmer into multiple queues in a queue list at the same time. By using syntax, we can do this quickly even for a large number of queues. With the queue list in question connected to the wheels, this is done automatically by finding the queue list since you just change the user setting, or by hitting the connect slash queue key, and then the, the select button of the queue list. This is sometimes they will connect on some consoles, queue on others. Press the record, then the connect slash queue key, then the first queue number, the through key, and then the last queue number. Take a record mode, and any masks if required, and then we press merge or replace, depending on which one we need. We can also use and, so if we wanted to update queues 1 through 7 and queues 10 through 30, we could use this syntax, 1 through 7 and 10 through 30. And then the same, uh, choose our record mode set correctly, any masks that we need, and then merge or replace. If we wanted to update this queues 1 and 10 and 30, we could use this syntax, 1 and 10 and 30. So let's take a look at that. So here I am on version 16 of the Titan Go virtual interface. See here I've got a queue list with uh, quite a few queues in it. Uh, so say I needed to merge uh, a zoom into all of these uh, playbacks at the same time. And we can't use tracking because we've got our tracking set to solo here. So we can't just set it in our first queue. So we need to record it into all of our queues. So we just go and select our points. And we're going to set our zoom to 100 because that's what we want it to be instead of 50. And then we can hit... And then we can bring up our queue list to have it active. And now we go ahead and hit record. The connect slash queue key. One, through four, seven, six. And you can see it highlighted all of our queues in our queue list here. And then I can either set my mask if we need to, check my record mode. In this case, uh, fixture won't do it for me. I want that in channel. And then I can go ahead and just hit merge. And give it a moment. And now it has merged that into all 476 of my queues. Let's say then on my washes here, I want to change them to be blue. And I need that to be in queues 1 through 10, and then 20 through 27. I can simply do, since my queue is already connected still, I can go ahead and record. The connect slash queue key 1 through 10, and... to 20 through 27 and see that it highlighted those only those cues in our queue list and then either merge or replace so we're going to do merge and now all those cues have been updated we can also do it say we want our nitros here we wanted them to be uh, at full dimmer on cues 1, 10, and 100. We can do record, Q, 1, and 10, and 100. And see that if we look at our list here, 1's been highlighted, 10's been highlighted, and we scroll all the way down here to 100. See it's been highlighted. And then we can merge or replace, depending on what we want. We'll go ahead and merge. It says merge our programming or programmer to those fixtures. So that has been how to use syntax to quickly update cues in your queue list. I hope you learned something. Join us on Facebook at AWS US. Join us here next time. Please subscribe. Thanks. Bye. Wheel stop. Roger. Wheel stop, Discovery. Welcome back. A great ending to the new beginning.